In this video we will take a look at the slide of umbilical cord. The slide is stained with hematoxine and eosine. That means that nuclei of uh, cells are violet and cytoplasm is pink. The umbilical cord consists of the outer uh, covering of the flatnet amnionic uh, epithelial cells. Here you can see the surface of the umbilical cord. Which, lining, uh, which is lining with the one layer of a squamous cell. Sometimes it's a, a cuboidal shape. Here you can see around nucleus of the cuboidal cells, but uh, very often it's a, a platelet, nuclei of platelet cells. So, and uh, interior. Uh, mass uh, of mesenchyme which is developed uh, into the Wharton's jelly. Wharton's jelly uh, is characterized of uh, widely spaced elongated fibroblast. Here you can see a nuclei of uh, fibroblast in the Wharton's jelly. And uh, the fibroblasts uh, are separated by a delicate three-dimensional uh, meshwork of fine collagen fibers so, uh, pink collagen fibers uh, very uh, very fine collagen fibers uh, which contains a variety of hydrated glucosaminoglycans in compressible water binding uh, with the uh, glucosaminoglycans helps to the umbilical vessels uh, keep uh, still opened so necessary for nutrition of uh, the fetus so you can see in the center of umbilical cord uh, there are two arteries one second artery and uh, one a vein uh, through the vein uh, Flow uh, the oxygenated uh, blood flows from the uh, from the mother to fetus, and uh, blood uh, come back through the uh, two arteries from a fetus into the mother. So arteries uh, have uh, the collapsed uh, lumen. It's not visible, good visible lumen, which is lining one layer of squamous uh, cells called endothelial cells. In the lumen, you can see erythrocytes of fetus and uh, wall of uh, the artery uh, contains a smooth muscle cells, uh, very wide wall of artery here is also artery not good visible lumen which lining one layer of squamous cells and in the lumen visible few erythrocytes of fetus and the vein uh, has a, a white uh, lumen Think, uh, think wall as uh, have arteries and also lining with one layer of uh, squamous cells. So that's all for the uh, umbilical cord. Thank you very much for your attention.